so guys since this video is about my baby i said let him do hello sunshine i said hello to my subscribers ha jesus oh boy yeah say hello look at the camera say hello guys subscribe to mommy's channel subscribe to mommy's channel so guys since the video is about to actually let him say hello to you guys so guys meet sunshine his name is actually shine but you can still call him sunshine sunshine say hello to my subscribers now bobo he just wants to you see the what he wants to take is comb and if i give it to him i know he will be calm i will not give him take this one take this one use this one and play so okay let me show you guys the stormy so that you guys will see that the reaction has cleared. Hey God, can this boy just, he doesn't even want to stand. Okay, hallelujah. Can you see the tummy? Can you see how smooth it is now? So big boy. So, if you're interested, please kindly watch this video to the end. Thank you. Oh, you're looking at camera now. No, no, I want to say bye-bye. I'm not going to show your face again. So say hello. Say hello. Say hello. Hello, guys. Thank you for watching and bye. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time on my channel, do not forget that I am from it and you're welcome to the Skin Freedom YouTube channel. On this channel, I do products review and things that will go lovely on your skin and um, I give you tips and bonus, you know? Yeah. So that, it's not really only skin. Uh, I'll, th I'll try and be bringing in more things into this. Like today now, I'm talking about skin, but not really, I'm not giving review today. I'm here to discuss with you guys. I'm here to tell you what worked for me so that you will try it. And this is for probably mothers only. Yeah. So from the earrings you saw, I'm here to tell you how I end up clearing my baby rashes and skin reaction. So if you're interested in this kind of video, I need you to do what? Subscribe and we'll be right back. This video is very, very personal to me because I just, um, I have a seven month old baby and, um, <laughs> For the past five months, he has been battling with skin infection and I've been so, so worried because I have a great skin. Looking at my son not having a great skin, looking at the way his skin is turning up, I've been very, very sad and down. Like, I've been so, so depressed. Do you understand? So, uh, I called my mom. I did all the local remedy they asked me to do. I did everything I was asked to do. Nothing was working. And a little bit of story, sorry, story time. One thing I need you to know as a mom is that you need to, in as well, the way you know your skin, the way you know that, oh, if I used to marry, you know, go work. If I used, to, I need you to, and don't care about what your baby wears alone. Don't care about what your baby eats alone. Care about your baby's skin. What works for your baby's skin? From the day my baby was born, I noticed it reacts to coconut oil. So when they gave birth to him, uh, at the antenatal, they told us to buy coconut oil. So coconut oil was what they used in cleaning his body. So after cleaning his body, he <laughs> it, it, it started having this reaction. Honestly, I wasn't in a good space when I just gave birth. So I didn't really... The funniest thing, I don't have my baby's picture or video for the first two weeks because I wasn't really in a good space. My pregnancy was not... My delivery journey was not really all that rosy. So I was not even on myself. But I was having this reaction... I don't know if my husband had a picture though. He was having this reaction all over his chest, right here. Like, like, dot, 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 all over his body. No, no. When they brought him out at first, when they cleaned him up and gave us, he was fine. He was good. Then, the next morning that the nurses said they wanted to bait him. So I gave them the same. I don't even know why I gave it to them. He has cream or. Probably they've not bought the cream I didn't pack it. I can't even remember. But I gave them the cream. I'm sorry, the oil that they should apply it to him as a body oil. So after taking his way, they applied it. Then later in the afternoon, I saw the rashes all over his body and everything. So when the doctor came the next day to come and check up on us, like normal rounds. So the, uh, the, the pediatrician now came, checked his body and said, uh-uh. No, sorry, I told her that, uh, uh, doctor, please, oh, 
no she was actually a nurse because i the last thing that i went they said she's a nurse so i saw the body of my son and i showed her then she said ah your baby has jaundice i said ah, the nurse my baby does not have jaundice this is just a skin reaction i'm eating skincare so i know when i see one he said no that this is jaundice so this one that one so they had to admit us they admitted us and they 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 admitted us that they did like oh my god they carried my baby to the intensive care they put me under one particular light then the the they cut his abdomen they said that was the only place they could transfer blood or take blood i don't know like that like i saw my baby i just started crying like i cried like i cried I, I would ask that was when i understand that wailing and crying they are too deep i wailed like i oh my god so to cut the long story short guys after three after three days or two days the reaction had cleared they said they gave him an injection to clear it then they told us that my baby does not have jaundice hello so we came back home my mommy will now want to sorry all these things are things that will make sense as the video goes so please i'm really sorry don't be bored so we came back home then my mommy said uh he was having colic they need to use udaki like i don't know Igbo people say udaki but it's made of coconuts do you understand i told my mommy i said do not apply this thing on my son he will react to it but you know i was a new mom my mommy <laughs> but where do mommies where do i had them new moms are their mommy they always fight doing of them going so my mommy we had issue because of that i had to take the oil i went to eat it so i went to eat it sorry so um my mommy now came back, saw the oil, applied it. My baby started having reaction. My mom said, ah, no, oh, no, Martin, this one, that one. So now, now, fast forward to now. So when I started seeing the reaction, mm, I, I, there was, there's a baby, there's a baby company that sells skincare products. I don't formulate baby skincare. Do you understand? So there's a baby, uh, there's a woman I follow online. I've been following her since 2018. I do I've done I don't even know what made me to start following her, but I've been following her since 2018. She sells baby product and I can I can do like this for her that her product works. So I wanted to buy a air care products for my baby because he has very, very full air. Like his air, you can literally pack them and they are very coily. So I don't want the coil to lose and I don't want his air to drop. So I bought baby uh, um, then I bought antiseptic soap, I bought cream. Accept it, so I saw that it's very good. They said it's for skin reaction. They saw baby, uh, this thing, anybody, uh, skin reaction that the baby had. Then I bought another cream. They say it's for baby reaction, so I just bought all those reaction cream. Then I bought the air set product. So I came back home and I started, uh, I ordered it, then I started using it for him. Then the first day I used it, I used the soap for the first time. My baby started scratching his body, like he would, he's smiling, but he's just doing like this. He's doing like this. Do you understand? He was doing like this. I was looking at him. He would not like. He was. He's lying inside a a a, a bat uh, a bat bowl. He would not do like this. He would not carry his chest up. Like if you are rubbing this soap, he would do like this. He would, would be squeezing his body. So I'm not like feeling like this thing is peppering him. So by the time I'm done bathing him, his skin is already red, like inflamed. Like his skin is red. I said, okay, maybe it's part of the work. I tried it the first day, I tried it the second day. Man, my baby skin was worse. Then I had to, then I said, I applied the baby oil I got, the same thing I applied. And I had to check the ingredients. That's so dumb of me. Imagine, I, that was one of the reasons I actually ordered on the website so that I can actually know what the ingredients, the product contains coconut oil. So the product is very, very good. Like, I can beat my chest on it their products are good i don't know the person personally but when you see somebody doing good well you know they are doing well jet stan so their products are very very good but i saw coconut oil in the three products especially the cold pressed soup i saw coconut oil there so i thought like, okay that was what was reacting to my baby so i do i dropped it i started using only the air product then i had to go to the hospital so i went to the hospital the doctor recommended something for me so my baby then he started he said i should be putting the toy inside his water then he said he re so recommended something for me that he maybe we should use this thing for like two weeks if it does not work then we have to go to surulere alva cosmetic no the alva road no alva road dermatologist clinic to go and uh you should take him there that if this does not work for him 
So I went to the pharmacy, I showed the pharmacist, it's right inside the hospital because the pharmacy was inside the hospital. Then the pharmacy was like, how old is my baby? I said, seven months. He said, ah, my baby cannot use this thing, no, that is too ash, this one, that one. Then he took it back to the doctor, then they did whatever they were doing. Even the pharmacy was even confused. Guys, I'm telling you guys, I'm coming. They were just, they were just, at the end of the day, they gave me this. They gave me this and they gave me this. They said I should give him this one from the inside. That if I give him this one from the inside, is um, the thing would clear up from the inside. And I read about this too. The indication is for they said is for allergic reactions. Do you understand? So then they said I should apply this ointment on the reaction. So I was giving this too. So they gave me this tool and I, I was so happy. I got back home after our picking our bait. I stopped using that soap anyway. So I started using another, uh, I started using Sebamed soap because I've been using Sebamed. Sebamed, a lot of people were like, ah, Sebamed will clear the reaction. Sebamed will clear the reaction. Sebamed actually helps to some extent. But another thing I noticed is like, as if cold press soap serve is not still, this boy's skin is just, guys, I was frustrated. I used this thing on my baby's skin. Then I woke up the next morning. Can you see? Okay, let me show you guys that one. Can you see this? Then this. Can you see? So I woke up the next morning. Guys, my baby skin has gone to bad to worst. The skin has gone from bad to worst. Like, that morning, I cried. Because I didn't snap it because... If I actually showed you guys how his skin, like it was irritating. My husband was so sad. He was like, "Hey God, I've never been in that kind of situation before." And then I said something. Said, "Hey, she be, she be, you're even doing cream. She be, you learn all this thing. You went to school for it. You don't even, you're you, 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 you giving other people solution. You, there's nothing you would do. You, you, you come up with something for your own son too. This, oh God, oh God. My baby skin. He woke up in the morning. Even though he was smiling." The skin was not was not giving was the skin was not even representing anything at all. I was so so sad. So what well, the first thing I had to do was I got original shea butter. So now this is now what I used. So I don't this is the picture of my baby, the reaction, some of the reaction. Then I'll be posting this is the picture of after. So you see the before and after in the cover picture, then but I'll leave it here. I will just leave it here. Yeah, yeah, do you understand? So, the the reaction, and I had to get shea butter. So, now these are the products that I used to clear my baby this thing. So, this is what my baby is using now. Do you understand? This is what I made for him to be using. So, and this is just original shea butter, like very, very original shea butter. Mm? Then I added uh, Chamoma Hall into it. I added a little bit of olive oil into this thing. Do you understand? So, I'm not going to lie to you guys. Those are the two things I did. Okay, before I said it, I said, the doctor, remember I said the doctor said I should be applying uh, antiseptic, either the tall or saffron time and with. I did it also. My baby skin was a mess. So, now, to this one back. So, this was what I did this. Then, I got a shower gel for him. Because I now noticed that his skin was becoming very dry and flaky. Like, when I say very dry and flaky, guys, my baby skin was peeling. Like, the skin was peeling. You would see, you would, you would see the skin tear me like this. Do you understand? Oof. Oof. So, uh, this was what I, I, I mixed Guys, I diluted, I dilute, I, I'm so sorry, like, I'm just, I'm just remembering and I feel, I feel so bad because it's too young to go through those kind of things. So, I, oh, Holy Spirit of God, what am I doing? <coughs> I melted the shea butter, I melted the shea butter, then I added in the two uh, oils I just told you guys now. I did not whip it. You can whip it up if, if you want, but I did not whip it. This is what works for me. It might actually work for you too. So I did not whip it. I just pour it back into it like this. Then I started using shower gel for him. Do you understand? You can either use Sebamed, you can use Boost Baby Secret, any shower gel that will 
you feel it's safe for your baby you can use angel shower gel you can use it for your baby i started using shower gel for him so these are the three i feel like these are the four things i did first of all this shea butter then i started using shower gel because he had very dry skin so i wanted a shower gel so i, I started using shower gel for him then secondly Whenever I, I, I use pure water to bathe him, so that's thirdly, I use pure water. I do not use any other oil to bathe aside from pure water. So it was strictly pure water I used in bathing him. Then I bought a, definitely, he has a separate kettle, but I made sure that that kettle was just strictly for him bathing alone. Do you understand? So I was using pure water to bathe him. Then whenever I put his bathing water, I apply this. Can you guys see? I applied this, I just applied like 10 drops inside this water, this baby oil. So I used baby, this baby oil, then I used liquid shower gel to bathe him, then I go in with the shea butter. Guys, that was what transformed my baby skin. Like, that was what transformed my baby skin. I didn't do much because I just tend to use the knowledge that I had because going to, we live on the, we live on the island. So having to go to Suilewe, guys, I've not been to the mainland in how many years. So I just said, let me use this. I have knowledge of this. So I know I've not tried it on a baby before, but so let me use it. I know what to do when clients tell me they have a dry skin. I know what to advise. I know what to give them and it's work. So, and I have a child. Why not do it for my own child? So if you are an even an adult and you have dry skin, this remedy works. You, you don't have to do all this shea butter. But adding uh, this oil, this particular oil, I use it because it's very lightweight. Adding this particular angel oil into your bathing soap. If you have dry skin, do this and thank me later. If you know somebody that has extremely dry and flaky skin, you know those kind of people that if they scrub their skin like this, you think there is dust in it. Let them try this. This baby oil, or I don't know about pears, but pears too is very okay. But this this uh, pear baby oil, but this angel oil, you can use pear baby oil, you can use boots oil, you can use angel oil. You apply it into your bathing water and you will see your skin improve. <laughs> guys this was what i did this is this was what i did and my baby skin is back to how it is because i remember the cl client that sent me a message one time and was complaining about that was the first time like i i i advise people on what to do to make their skin come back to life and i have a child so that's what i've been doing so this has been my lifesaver you see this uh mixed shea butter that i did and this baby oil. Uh, sorry, guys. I added 0 0.5% of uh, turmeric oil inside this. 0 0.5% turmeric oil. 0 0.5% turmeric oil. 0 0.5. So, then... The, oh, guys. I'm just so happy to share this with you guys. So, if you know your baby is suffering from skin reaction, something similar to... Hey, well, something similar to what my baby suffered from. And you've tried every other thing. Your baby's skin is still the way it is. Mm? Just try what I just told you. Stay away if your baby is having all this kind of skin reaction. Stay away from anything antiseptic because it's actually inflamed your baby's skin, which I don't know. It's inflamed my baby's skin. I don't know for you, but you know everything. You, you just have to keep trying and trying before you get the best. So I know the particular soap you're using, mm, and also monitor your baby's skin. Know what works for your baby. Do you understand? Know what works for your child. Do not just use whatever you see and say, oh, "Okay, this is it." Look at like this product that I said my baby is using. Do you understand? I'm still going to try and get another one, but this time around, I would be sure that there's no coconut oil. I will even try them that any other product doesn't have coconut oil because, um, in as much as um, I'm using this shea butter, I also want him to use a moisturizer, but that would not be now probably after a year. One is one year, so plus. So, uh, I hope this video was useful to you. I hope you learned one or two things. Always monitor your baby's skin. After you understand, my baby does not like cold breast soap. It doesn't like coconut oil. And this is just what worked for my baby's skin. And I just, the funniest thing that I came up with this thing 2 a.m. in the midnight when I was like, I, I was just cracking my head out. What can I do for my son? Like, going to Surulere. And I got to go to Surulere. Everything has the skin is back to how it used to be my black boy thank you so much for watching and if you find this video helpful please please don't watch without subscribing mm? i shared my knowledge with you i shared what worked for me so please do not do what do not watch without subscribing and my next video probably not next but i'll share another video on cream that you can actually apply on your baby's skin products are very safe for the babies thank you so much for watching